the roller derby. It's a good way to make a living, especially for a girl. 75 or 100 bucks a week, or more if you score points. Like Annis Jensen, say, or Fuzzy Buchik. If the crowds like you, if you can dish it out and take it. A girl like Tuffy Brashoon, number 12 there, can draw down 10 grand a year. And then if there's a wedding ring on your mind, there's the men's team. With the roller derby, a girl has a good chance of meeting the right guy. A fellow with what they call similar interests. Plenty of the kids are married, like Tuffy and Ken Marty. And between them, they can sort away their dough and see big chunks of the US, Chicago, LA, New York, for works. Laying out the schedule every night. Practicing every day. A good way to make a living. You learn to respect the rails from the minute you're a rookie. Or hoping to be a rookie. A kid fresh off the local roller rinks. A kid who maybe figures she's tired of the cows and chickens or an assembly line or slinging hash. A kid who comes around when the roller derby hits her town and asks one of the coaches for a tryout. And gets signed up with the New York team. A kid like that, like Gene Porter, worries a lot about the rails. Because they're not only a natural hazard, but because the old timers like to rough the rookies up a little. Put a little fear in them. Keep them from competing for the newspaper headlines and the extra dough that goes with being a roller derby star. See what I mean? And as you lie there kind of groggy, you hear a voice. A special voice. And it's saying your name. It's saying, go after it. You go get her. So you're up somehow. Go after Tuppy. Let her worry about the rails now. And she goes down, hard, and the whistle blows. It's the end of the period. The men take over, the game goes on. And back on the bench, you steal a look at Tuffy on her bench. And there are tears in her eyes. And suddenly you get the idea. Well, she can be hurt. She can be scared too. And then you sneak a look at Peggy, the girl who always seems so hard boiled. And... Yeah. They're all soft way down deep. Yes, all of them. Don, too, with his number 23. But they don't show it. They keep fighting. Fighting the competition, the rails, everything. No, they don't give up. They stick right in there. Because it has its good points, too. Something that kind of dawns on you, like life itself. And you don't just quit because of the danger or because the going's rough. You don't quit when you get banged around. You don't quit because you're scared or hurt. No, sir. You get up and you start going around again. <laughs> 